With Alfresco Media Management, you can manipulate videos directly in Alfresco. In the document library, you can see information relating to images and video. You can see the video length. This might be useful to understand whether a video is full length or edited. Click a video to open a preview. If you're the first user to open a video file, in most setups you'll see a progression bar indicating the time estimated for the video to load. This can take a while depending on your system setup and the size of the file. The video is then available for everyone in your organisation. On the right side of the screen, you can publish your video to Zencoder Brightcove or Amazon CloudFront channels, depending on your system settings. There is a new renditions panel which lists the media formats available. You can click the plus icon to generate a new format that hasn't already been requested. Click a rendition to view it. The Properties panel shows properties relevant to your video. There are PB Core editions which specify video duration and other properties. You can add comments to the video timeline. Stop the video at the point you want to capture and add a comment. When you or another user next views the refresh video, the comment is available on the timeline. You can now toggle the comments as subtitles on the video. Clicking the edit icon gives you several options. You can resize the video screen. You can trim the video length, either as a copy or as a version of the original. To trim the video, pull the bars at the beginning and end of the video to the point you want to trim to. When you are done, click the trim icon. Each time the video is edited, it creates a new rendition. You'll see that a trim copy of the video has been created. In the document library, the copy has been created alongside the original image.